Well, auction volumes were up, but house values were down across the major capitals as markets struck a balance between demand and reality last week. The approaching winter months usually put a dent in auction numbers, but over the weekend, listings were up more than 50% on the corresponding week in 2013, a sign that the demand for property will keep firing right through to spring. And looking at the numbers now, and Sydney led the way for auction clearances with a solid 76.2% from 1,075 auctions. Adelaide was next best with 67.2%, but a lot less at 121 auctions. And Melbourne the, had the most homes to go under the hammer for the week and managed to clear 61.7%. Looking at the private treaty prices, Sydney's median price of $700,000 for houses from 1,811 sales was far and away the, the biggest result. Melbourne at 1,555 sales pulled in a 485,000 median price, while Perth is on the way down but has managed to keep its head above 500,000 from 698 sales. For apartments, Sydney again with miles of front, $545,000 from 910 sales. Melbourne, $420,000, probably sliding a little bit still. Really good value in Adelaide, $302,000, median price from 87 sales. Looking at the home value changes, it was another negative week for the capital cities ahead of winter. Uh, Adelaide had the worst of it, down 1% for the week, still up 4.9% year on year. Sydney was the next biggest faller, 0.7%. It slid, still up 16.8% this on this time last year, which means there's still plenty of room to fall there. Um, Perth continuing its downward trend, minus 0.6%, now just up 5.7% annually, and Melbourne also slipping 0.5%. So there we have it. A uh, bit of a stall for most of the capital city markets for the, for the week, and indeed for this month after a fast start to the year. There's now a lot of value out there for both buyers and sellers uh, who know where to look. So uh, get out there and see what you can find. Thanks, and we'll see you next week on Clearance Rate.